Hello, this is Pranay and through this simple video, I shall help you understand how do you draw the IMR plot using Minitab and how do you draw inference from the same. IMR as a control chart is to be built when you have continuous data and you have single subgroup. So I go to stats, control charts for individual. I can either do the IMR together or I and MR separately. So the first chart I will draw is the moving range chart. I'll double click on collections. I go to scale, I go to stamp, and I put the choose the date column here. So C2, which has dates, press OK. Here you go, the control chart is done. The first thing that you should look at is to check whether any data points are going outside the red lines of the upper control limit and the lower control limit. If they are not, it is saying that the process is within the statistical control. Let me do the I chart also. So I go to stats again, control charts for individual and the individual chart. Double click collections, click scale, choose stamp, choose the column in which you have dates, C2 in my case, press OK, OK. So the first chart you should always build is the variation chart. So if you are building the IMR, do the MR first. If MR is out of control, no point looking at the I chart. So here you see that the process is within statistical control because none of my data points are going outside the red line. Also look at the other videos where I've shown you the eight special tests that are possible for continuous data. You may want to check for other patterns present in the data. So I chart options, test, you can choose these tests I am not elaborating these tests here in this particular control chart. Press OK. There is no special cause variation present in the data. So you are to conclude that your process is within statistical control. For a single subgroup, IMR chart. I hope this video helps you understand how do you draw. Thank you.